A candidate for New York State Senate says he's running because Albany is to blame for our area's high property tax rates. Republican Mike Sigler is currently a Tompkins County legislator who is challenging Democratic incumbent Leah Webb is next month's election. Sigler says he's seen firsthand the financial burden the state puts on counties through unfunded mandates. Among them is the division of how Medicaid is paid for. New York is the only state that pushes half of its Medicaid burden onto the counties. What's worse, Sigler says, is that Washington has a federal Medicaid assistance program that is supposed to provide relief to counties, but the state keeps all of that money for itself. Sigler says that creates a huge financial hole with Broome County, missing out on $5 million it would have if New York passed along the FMAP money. The county only has two places to get money. It's the property tax or the sales tax. We don't control the sales tax, so it's the property tax where that money is going to come from. And people just, you're looking at property tax. You can't sell your garage, right, to pay your property tax. So now you've got a huge hole in your, in your own budget, and how do you pay that? And that's what people are struggling with. Sigler says the state's mandate that school districts electrify their buses will also add to the property tax burden for local taxpayers.